guys welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video dark areas on the body such as the absolute areas now we all know that dark inner ties could be caused from friction of the legs when your legs rub together it create this darker area and also if you wear like tight clothing today I'm gonna make this wonderful exfoliator for you I'm using ingredient that is loaded with vitamin C and vitamin C is known to get rid of dark areas on the skin I'm also gonna use ingredient that is known to get rid of the dead skin cells and I'm using other ingredient that is known to moisturize the skin so overall you're getting a complete scrub that's gonna exfoliate clear and brighten and also soften the skin so if you're interested in today's video continue watching our first ingredient is rice and you can use any rice that you have whether it is white rice or brown rice now rice acts as a great exfoliator it will help to get rid of the dark patches on the skin such as the inner thighs the elbows the knees now rice not only exfoliate the skin but it also help to tighten and firm the skin rice also is great for getting rid of wrinkles it has been used for centuries especially in the asian communities on the skin for having the skin looking younger and fresher. Our next ingredient is coffee beans. And coffee also acts as a great exfoliator. Coffee helps with circulation. Coffee will help the blood to flow. So if you have like spider veins or varicose veins, coffee will help to shrink or get rid of these veins. Now coffee when mixed with rice is gonna act as a strong exfoliator that's gonna get rid of the dark spots and blemishes on the skin now take a look at the third ingredient and for this you have a choice you can choose to use a lemon or you can choose to use lime use whichever you have now I'm using the lemon or the lime because of the citric acid citric acid will help to brighten that skin the peel of the lemon and the lime is also loaded with vitamin C which will help to brighten the skin so these two are used in this remedy as a brightening agent our final ingredient is the oil of your choice you can choose to use coconut oil almond oil soya bean oil whatever oil that you have available to you in this recipe however i am going to be using olive oil you're also going to need a blender and a grater for this recipe so now we're going to prepare the ingredient and the first thing i'm going to do i'm going to blend the coffee beans so i'm going to be blending a quarter cup of coffee beans do not use flavored coffee beans. Make sure it's just fresh, pure coffee beans. Now here is the blended coffee beans. Notice they are granules, not too fine. You do not want to blend it to a powder since you need that exfoliating effect, okay? And we're gonna be doing the same thing to the rice. So I'm gonna be using a quarter cup of rice and like I said before, go ahead and use whatever rice you have, whether it is brown rice or white rice. And here we have our blended rice. And just as we did with the coffee beans, you want to make sure not to overblend the rice. It should definitely have some granules. And take a look at this up close. Moving on to our lemon or lime i'm going to be using both the lemon zest and the lemon juice so we're going to begin by zesting the lemon so to zest the lemon is pretty easy you're going to just use your grater and you're just going to rub it on the grater like this do not go too deep you do not want the pit you're just zesting the outer peel since I have my lime right here, I'm gonna zest a little of the lime also. Do not worry, choose to use one, but if you have both, why not? And here we have our lemon and lime zest. Now after zesting the lemon, we're just gonna cut our lemon in two halves. 
like this. Remove the seeds and we're going to put it aside. So here we have all the ingredients ready. We have our blended rice. We also have the blended coffee beans. We have our lemon, olive oil, and our lemon zest and lime. And now we're going to put everything together. I'm going to be using three tablespoons of the blended rice. Three tablespoons of the blended coffee. And this is about enough. One teaspoon of our lemon, lime, and zest. Remember, if you have only lemon or lime, just use whatever you have or blend both as I just did here. So we're first going to mix the dry ingredient together. Mix well. And this smells amazing, guys. And now that this is blended nicely, we're going to move on to our liquid. For our lemon, I'm going to use about a tablespoon of fresh squeezed lemon juice. So you're just going to squeeze it directly. About a tablespoon. And this one is very juicy. And that's good. Now we are not going to throw this out, but you're going to leave it because we're going to be using this to exfoliate the skin. Moving on to our olive oil. And you only need a tablespoon of olive oil. Remember, use whatever oil you have. We're going to pour this in. And now we are going to blend. Slowly blend this in. Now, if it's a little too dry, you can go ahead and add a little bit more of the lemon juice. If you have sensitive skin, go easy with the lemon juice and use the olive oil. So mine is a little dry, so I'm going to pour a little bit of olive oil. Just a little tip more of olive oil, about a teaspoon. And then I'm going to blend. And now our body scrub is ready. Take a look. This is what it should look like up close. And next, I'm going to show you how to use this for best result. To use, you want to use this at least two to three times per week. Make sure to focus on the dark areas, especially the inner ties. Now you want to make sure to wash the hair thoroughly before you apply. Next, you're going to take a handful, and this is best done in the shower since it could get a little messy, okay? So you take a handful, wet the area, and just apply it. A little pressure in circular motion and just keep exfoliating for about three minutes on each side. If you're doing your elbows, you do the same thing. Your knees, just do the same thing. So just exfoliate. And once you're done, you're going to rinse this off with some warm water. Now take a look very soft and very smooth. Now, if you're using this on the elbows and knees, an easy way to do it is to use the lemon. So you're just going to dip the lemon in, scoop up as much, and then reach for your knees or your elbows and just use the lemon. Now you want to continue to use this until you achieve the result you are looking for. Now, this is not only for people with dark patches on the body. You can actually use this as a complete body scrub. If you have spider veins, varicose veins, this is a wonderful scrub to use. You can also choose to add a little bit of a eucalyptus oil to this for further relaxation. Now, this scrub can be stored in the refrigerator for about seven to 10 days. It definitely does not have anything in there that is gonna go bad except for the lemon juice. So you can choose to leave the lemon juice out and when you're about to use it, you just squeeze the 
lemon juice in so there you now, have it thank you all for watching remember if you like the video just give it a thumbs up because it's really up the channel also leave your comments those are also welcome and if this was the first time watching i'm sure you want to see more of these videos so look below you're going to see the word subscribe just click on it and you will be subscribed also beside the word subscribe there's a little bell if you click on that you will get a notification each time i upload a video basically right away okay so thank you all for watching and i'll see you in my next video bye bye